everyone, Monroe still here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel and another Miami birthday weekend vlog. It's going to be a good one so make sure you give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. Alright guys, it's my birthday weekend. And we are back with another Miami birthday vlog. These are always so much fun, jam packed with friends. We are doing a beach day, we're doing a dinner, we're doing a yacht day, we're doing some shopping. I'm doing some unboxings of gifts and things I bought myself and things I've been sent by brands. It's gonna be a good one. Um, so yeah, to start off, uh, my girl Gloria is here. We are about to head to breakfast. We're going to one of my favorite places here in Miami Beach, Esme Hotel. They have this really great restaurant that I love for their breakfast. But do keep in mind that they stop serving breakfast at 11.15. So you wanna make sure you get there before then. So we did a little workout this morning. I got myself together. I am wearing this bodysuit, no longer made, but Skims has a similar one. The lip is absolute New York. It's called Modest Matte. You can get it at Walmart, I'll link it. And the skirt is from Desigual. Um, it is their Stella Jean collection. You would have seen this in a recent haul video. Of course, I wanted to go ahead and get this on. I'm gonna choose a scent, an earring, a bag, and we are going to head out. Also, y'all, my girl Brittany of Pockets and Bows is also in town, so she will be making a cameo in today's vlog. So yeah, I'm very, very excited. Um, Yesterday, we actually began the birthday festivities. Um, Maria and I, Maria Bella Rosa Blog here on YouTube, we got together and we shot all of my birthday looks that I will be posting throughout the weekend on Instagram. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let the montage of those outfits play out for you all. I did a little sneak peek in the previous vlog, but let's get into my birthday fits. enjoyed that birthday montage the first look was this beautiful gradient Fina well dress it's like a ruche dress off the shoulder stunning I love the colors how it just cascades and Maria and I actually went to Vizcaya Museum here in Miami to shoot that look we thought it would just be beautiful they have like this little canopy that's out over the water and I mean the photos turned out so incredible. I'll pop a few of them up here from Instagram. But yes, thank you guys for all the love. That was my birthday dress, the one that I waited on, and it was worth every penny. I'm going to be wearing this dress into the ground. Y'all know how much I love Fina Well, Black on Business. I think she is incredible doing big things. The next look we shot is from Indigo Studio, which I also believe is a 50% Black owned business. Um, stunning. I love their pleats. It's a two piece set with like this beautiful like bralette top that almost looks like a shell and these beautiful like kind of poofy pleated shorts in this beautiful satin like a burnt orange and we also shot that at Vizcaya Museum but we wanted a more like almost like jungle theme and I mean the, that, that museum gives you so many options when it comes to photos and we just had the time of our lives shooting that look there um, yeah, I actually wore an Indigo Studio dress for the last New Year's, which was this off-the-shoulder green dress. I'll pop a video or a photo up here. Indigo Studio, a wonderful designer brand. Um, and the things are, that they create are just one of a kind. You're going to stand out. 
And then last but not least, you already saw this fit, but it was this beautiful dress. It's a black netted dress and I wore this on the beach here in Miami Beach. Um, my Maria and I found this really cool like golden log that I guess just washed up out of the sea and I guess someone the city painted it gold and it just worked out perfectly with that beautiful black netted dress that I got from Henna um, Nail and Spa. They have a pop up there. Um, yeah, the dress, stunning. I will link everything that I wore those three birthday looks uh, down below in the description box and you guys can check it out. So yeah, we started the festivities for my birthday last night. We actually went to Joya Beach, which is a, a great restaurant here in Miami. Um, it has a beautiful beach setting, like tables are out on the sand and you can see Brickle or kind of like downtown the um, like high rises um, in the distance. And it's just a beautiful view. My girl uh, Farrah Pink joined Gloria, Rhea, Michelle, and I there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna rewind it back to last night when I wore this stunning Fina Well dress. And I'm gonna let that footage play, take you guys with us on my first birthday night dinner, and then we'll come back here and head to brunch. <laughs> Hey y'all, so I rewinded it back for you all. Um, I'm getting ready to head to my first birthday event, which is a quaint and intimate dinner at Joya Beach. Um, if you watch my vlog where my girl Peyton Marie Charles came, um, she and then Brie and I, we went to Joya Beach and I had such a good time that I wanted to go back for my birthday. So I planned a little intimate dinner with some of my girls and we're gonna head there for tonight. Because y'all know there's a look for every occasion. I am wearing this Fee Noel um, dress. I absolutely love this dress. As soon as I saw this, I had to have it. Um, I'm wearing the small. It is quite stretchy. You can definitely probably size down one size if you want it to be very fitted. Um, I'm normally a medium. It is very long. I'm five foot six, but it fits great. And I just love the colors, how everything just kind of melts into different colors. Um, I did a very everyday makeup look. The lip is NARS Mysterious Red. On my eyelids, I have the Laura Mercier um, chocolate. And that is the look. You would have seen this entire outfit at the beginning of the video when I did a montage. But there will be more looks because tomorrow we're starting the day at Nikki Beach, which should be fun. I have two looks for that. And then on Sunday, of course, we're having a yacht day. Sunday, May 15th is actually my birthday. So it should be fun. And I have a, a bathing suit for that as well. So very excited for Joya Beach. I have been Thinking about that crispy lobster that I had the last time, like I cannot wait. It's gonna be so good. So let's go ahead and choose a scent. I think today we're gonna go with Baccarat Rouge 540 because it's my absolute favorite. And of course, why wouldn't I wanna smell like Rich on my birthday? I think I'm going to add a little bit of the Te Noir as well from Le Labo. Y'all know this is my favorite mixture. And I need to decide on an earring. Um, I'm not sure if I wanna do like something kind of chic, yet that makes a statement like these Chanel earrings, or if I wanna do something kind of boho like these. Hmm. What do you think? I like the chic with it actually. You like the Chanel? Something, yeah. Really okay. Well. So that's Gloria. <laughs> she is here. Um, you would have seen her probably at the beginning of the video anyway, but she's getting ready in the bathroom. She told me she likes the Chanel. Yeah. So we're gonna go with the Chanel. And because the restaurant is on a beach, like half of it is on a beach, your table could be on the beach. You could just kick off your shoes. Um, so, I'm gonna wear my Tibby Mules with this dress. I think it will look great. 
Um, and if not, I need to, if we're on the sandy part of the restaurant, I'll just kick them off. Put my feet in the sand and enjoy. So that is tonight's look. Um, I'm gonna call us an alto. Don't forget, I have a code Monroe20, all capital letters for 20, for twenty dollars off your first two rides at Ride Alto, just download it. Go to RideAlto.com. Download the app; it's amazing. They have it in Miami. They have it in LA. They have it in Texas. They have it in DC. Um, you will absolutely love it, and you will get twenty dollars off your first two rides with my code. Mm, I feel cute. All right. Let me show you the full look. Okay, so here is the dress and here is the look. Wearing NARS Mysterious Red, Chanel earrings, Finoel dress, which is a black owned business. And then my Tibby um, mules. Feel like it gives it a nice little boho look. Plus these are mules. I can kind of walk um, really easily in these and just kick them off when it's time to head into the sand. Um, loving this look. I think for the bag, I'm gonna take my Brandon Blackwood, um, the shell bag, because this is really giving like tropical, and I wanna keep with that theme. So I think tonight we're gonna go with this like canvas tote with the cowrie shells. It's a small bag, it'll fit my camera um, and anything else I need. So that is tonight's full look, and I love it. All right, guys, this is Gloria's look for the evening. Make sure you are following Life with Glory B over on her Instagram and over on her YouTube channel. So who are you wearing, miss? Okay, you know what? This dress is by some brand on Wolf. I'm so, so sorry. <laughs> and um, the bag and the shoes. Okay, give me the bag. Oh, oh the bag. Honestly, I'm not ready for this. Oh, mama. my God, the shoes. Well, I mean, I got the color Gaia <laughs> unlocked, but the other stuff, I'm sorry guys, but head to glorious, me, head to glorious channel and for details. Get into those hips. Those, hips those non-existent <laughs> hips. <laughs> Let's I'm say trying to create. You got hips, honey, because I can see them in the you know in the mirror right there. Yes, there you go. I always have to create some too. I'm like up and down. All right, we gotta get a picture of you tonight. It'll be cute at the place. All right, let's. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. For the back Again, wearing this little bodysuit that I wear all the time. The skirt is from De Sigual, the Stella Jean collection, and I'm wearing a medium. It's just so fun. Like, I'm glad that I'm able to wear this, like, during my birthday week. And my shoes are these brand new Chanel sandals that I got in when I was in New York, shopping at Bergdorf's, when I was um, staying at the Plaza with Kiehl's. You would have seen that in a previous vlog. So these are one of my birthday gifts to myself. Let me show them. So they are super comfortable. 
Um, this is kind of like a stretchy type of neoprene. Of course, it has those CCs there. It has a thick, cushy sole, and this is very comfortable. So I got these in a 41. I got them at Bergdorf's. They had this pair and a black pair, um, but someone else bought the black pair, and then they had these on hold, and finally I was like, she's not gonna buy them, so give them to me. <laughs> and so this is my birthday gift to myself. I think they came in at 9.75, um, but very, very comfortable and happy to have these. My first pretty much birthday gift to myself. Definitely check out Chanel stores if you're interested. They do come in black. I think the black would be a little easier to wear, but I already have a few black sandals, so I wanted something a little more chic, and I love the black and beige. So I definitely have more things that I bought that I'm gonna show you guys um, when I get back from breakfast, but I'm just gonna pop on these Ana Luisa earrings and a little bit of gentle fluidity mixed with Joe Malone wood, sage, and sea salt. It's been a minute. Y'all know, I used to wear my gentle fluidity into the ground, but I want something just super light today. This does smell like gold. Like I understand why they named it gentle fluidity gold. <laughs> So I'm gonna mix it a little bit with wood, sage, and sea salt by Jill Malone, which is, this is just like the smell of Miami to me. It smells like vacation, it smells fresh. And I love the mixture of these two. So I will link both of these down below if you are interested. Of course, Jill Malone is a lot more affordable than Maison Francis, but you know, it's a birthday weekend. So that is the look. I think I'm gonna carry my Brandon Blackwood bag, the shell one. You would have seen this in my handbag, my luxury handbag video. And that is today's look. So let's go to brunch. a super quick brunch at Esme Hotel. Um, I was very hungry, so I ended up ordering everything. Of course, I got a coffee. Their coffee is delicious. Um, we got some hash browns. I got the BLT. We got this kind of like, kind of like a wrap with egg and sausage and salsa. Um, and then Gloria had the Huevos Rancheros. It's very cute there. I always tell you guys, if you're looking for a really just fun place to stay, definitely check out Esme. I think they're actually having a drag brunch today, but we couldn't stay for that. We had to come back here and get ready because we are going to Nikki Beach. But of course, I wanted to show you guys a few things that I got in before we head off. I've already shown you my brand new Chanel sandals, um, but let me show you a few more things. So I got these shoes from Mango. You would have seen me try these on in a previous New York City vlog. They just opened a like flagship store on Fifth Avenue. So if you're in New York City, definitely check it out. But I think these are so cool. The poofy trend is really in. I got a size 40. I'm normally a 41 or a size 10, but the 40 fits fine. And I just love the poofiness. 
I think they are super cool. They have a thick heel. You can pretty much wear them all day. And they came in at 129. I also popped into Zara and I bought that beautiful kind of um, purplish pinkish one shoulder dress that I wore when I was at the Plaza Hotel and to a dinner and a cocktail hour with Kiehl's. Um, you guys love that dress by the way. But in addition to buying that dress, I also bought this skirt and I believe this skirt is going to be the biggest thing that comes out of Zara. They have a limited edition collection. This skirt is like a satin skirt and it's really punchy hot pink. It's high waisted and it has a little slit in the back. Y'all this skirt is everything. Okay. I ordered it and um, I actually bought the size small because this is the only one they had in the store. Um, it's a little bit tight. Luckily, I went online and they have a medium online, so I ordered that and it's on its way. Once that comes, I'll kind of decide and just take the other one back. But this skirt is everything. Next up, you guys already know from my previous video that I am doing an Amazon The Drop collection. I let you guys know on my May 15th Sunday video that went live um, on my actual birthday. Um, so yeah, I wore a dress from Karen's collection to kind of announce it to you all. And I just got these pants in also from Karen Britchick's collection from The Drop. And I think they're so cool. I love that asymmetrical um, closure there. I love the cargo pockets. And what I really love about these pants is you can wear them kind of straight like a cigarette pant, but also they have buttons here so you can kind of determine how cinched you want the pants and i like to wear them on the last button to give it a more baggy feel um i think that was such a genius design technique so shout out to karen of course the waist is elastic in the back um, and it comes with this little utility belt you guys know i do a lot of utility belts in my collections with something by sanji so absolutely love these pants i think the color it's so fun for spring. I think this will look great with navy blue, with white, with cream, um, with black. So happy to have these. I got them in a size medium um, and I love the fit. Definitely planning on shooting these soon. Also, do not forget to sign up. Click the link down in the description box and sign up for notifications on Amazon The Drop so that you will be notified when my drop takes place. It's only going to be live for 30 hours and I don't want you guys to miss it. It's very much my style. If you like my style, you're gonna love this collection. It is colorful, it's vibrant, it's fun. It's gonna get you through the end of summer. So yeah, click the link down below. Make sure to sign up so you are notified when my drop happens. Next up, I got a dress in from Fame and Partners. They sent this over for my birthday, um, which I really, really love. Fame and Partners is really cool. I believe it's an, an Aussie brand. I have a few of their dresses. What I love about them is the dresses are made to order, so there's no waste, which is incredible. I mean, some dresses they have in stock, others are made to order. This one I actually had made specifically to order. They will take your measurements, you input everything, and then you get the dress a few weeks later. I loved this design with these two straps here. You could do a halter, you could do a side strap. The color is stunning. It has a little knot in the middle, and then it is a beautiful kind of like long, flowy, um, maxi dress. I got the US size 6, UK size, U, um, Australian size 10. Um, and it fits great. It's beautiful satin as well. So I will link a few dresses that I'm loving from Fame and Partners. If you're looking for a really standout occasion dress without breaking the bank too much, definitely check them out. The quality is A1. And shout out to them for sending this over. Next up, I got a few earrings in from Hoop Mob, which is a black owned business. Definitely check them out. I'm actually going to be working with them to create like some reels and some content. So I'm really happy about that. The first are these and the packaging is everything. I will link them down below because their jewelry is very affordable. Um, and even though it's very affordable, it's very well made and it lasts. Africa earrings. I've always wanted some. So you guys know 
Juneteenth is coming up and I vlogged last Juneteenth in New York City and New York City is where you want to be for Juneteenth. You go to Brooklyn, you go to the park, you go to some parties. If you have not watched that video and you don't have no idea what Juneteenth is, y'all gotta go watch it because it was a time. Ugh, they're everything. They're huge too. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my hair done. I'm gonna put it in Bantu knots with the braids and then have these earrings. It's gonna be good, it's gonna be good. I will link these earrings down below in case you are interested. Y'all know, I love a gold look. Next up from Hoop Mob, I have these. And I like these because they're a, kind of like a mid-sized hoop, but they are a neutral color. And I don't have a ton of like neutral color earrings. They almost feel like rubber, but you see how they're like a mocha brown color? which is really nice. Like say if you're wearing something super bright and you just want kind of an understated earring, I love them. And I believe these do come in a few different colors. So I would be sure to link every pair I show you all today. Let's see what else I got. I got so much stuff, like I kind of forgot what all I ordered. Ooh, I really like these. So I'm into a clear earring. I think clear is in look at these look how thick they are they're very very lightweight almost like a plexi glass but i think clear earrings are a vibe especially when you have a lot going on like with my hair i have all of these twists i mean i have all of these braids so it's understated but it still makes a statement so these are the clear i got this super cute taurus necklace i love that it's tourist season and of course they have all of the zodiac signs so look how cool that is oh i have two more pair of earrings another hoop but this one is more like an oval shape hoop and again all of these earrings are super affordable and again this is also a black owned business look how these look so these are more of like a, a muted gold it's more like a teardrop instead of being a hoop. Those are cute. I can see this with an, a cute summer outfit for sure. And I also like that these have the connected back so you don't have to worry about an earring back. Yeah, these are cute. It's giving around the way, girl, especially, especially with the necklace. And these come in a little box. I love their packaging, by the way. And these are the Nefertiti earrings, but these are studs and they are so freaking cute. Let me put them on for you. Oh, that's cute. I love the size, I love the shape. Very well made. I have like a Nefertiti bus in my Harlem apartment, like a photo in my bay window. So I'm obsessed with these. All right guys, so that's everything I got from Hoop Mob. If you're interested, I've linked everything down below. Super affordable um, earrings, necklaces, jewelry that you will absolutely love. Last, but certainly not least, I got something from my girl Marche. I don't know if you follow her on Instagram, but you should be Marche Robinson. She is incredible and amazing and I love her content. But she has come out with her own brand. I believe it's called Azaline or Azaline. I'm gonna have to ask her. But look at this packaging, beautiful. Let's open it up. It says, get ready to replenish, rehydrate, and restore with Azaline Beauty, www.azalinebeauty.com. Ezaline. Thank you for putting that on there, girl. Look how gorgeous she looks. So she has come out with a stunning hair care brand. This is amazing. Let's get into the products. Like, I know it, it takes so much to like create your own products and I'm just so happy for her. And then she also like wanted to include me in Ezaline. Ezaline. Moreau, hey boo. Thank you so much for all the support. Congrats again on your new home. I can't wait for you to try our hair, our hero product, the hair treatment mask. I hope you love it as much as I do. 
Okay, so here is the product. I love the packaging. I love the colors. This is the Easeline Hair Treatment Mask. It's the packaging for me. Come through Marche. She did that. This is what it looks like. It smells amazing. It's very light. Slightly sweet and fluffy. Oh, it smells so good. The hair treatment mask. I'm going to try this as soon as I take my braids out and give you guys the tea. But so far, loving it. Love the packaging. Everything is absolutely stunning. It also came with this cute comb. How cute is that? And then there's a little something in this pouch. Oh, it comes with this little like satin like hair tie. Like for when you're doing your makeup and such, you can put your hair up. Very nice. Oh, and also a little hair tie, a satin hair tie. Very nice. Wait, there's something else in here. A satin pillowcase embroidered with my name. It's, it's, it's the details for me. I love this. Wow. Make sure to check out Isaline. Shout out to my girl, Marche. Um, I'm so happy for her. Um, it's really hard to like transition into having an actual product when you've been the product as like a content creator so i'm so happy for her and i can't wait to try this i will link her business down below another black owned business i mean we coming through all right you guys i have to do a tiny bit of work i will check back in when i have my bathing suit on and we are headed to nikki beach but uh, if you are enjoying the birthday vlog thus far, please do give your girl a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell so that you never miss a video. I'll check in with you guys soon. All right, guys. So we are all ready for a day at Nikki Beach. I am wearing this Andrea Iyama one-piece bathing suit, black-owned business. You guys know I love her. Um, it is stunning. And this yellow... And then I am wearing this Loewe scarf that I bought specifically for this occasion because I know the yellows matched. So it's just like a long scarf. The sunglasses are from Alexander McQueen. I got these not too long ago. I feel like the pink matches. And then of course I have on my favorite little cowrie shell anklet. We are going to take this Loewe basket bag that you would have seen in my luxury handbag video collection because it fits everything um, i sprayed on a little baccarat rouge 540 and i'm gonna throw on my chanel dad sandals and we are heading out
everyone today is the day it's my birthday <laughs> um yesterday was so fun at nikki beach it was my first time actually experiencing nikki beach so i just want to send a shout out to them because they hooked that up for me um and <laughs> they really took care of us we had this really lovely cabana with a table they brought us a rosé they brought us two platters of food um we got the miami platter which came with like burgers tacos um uh calamari and then we also had the sushi um platter which was really good i definitely recommend those two platters um it's enough food for about five six people for sure um but yeah the ambiance was nice the sun was sunning it was so hot out there y'all um we were sweating but my girl jen john pierre came with her husband um jermaine and of course ria michelle was there and of course my girl gloria was there um a few other people couldn't make it it was fine i still had an amazing time and i definitely want to go back and visit nikki beach if you're looking for something to do during the day you just want to chill you want to listen to a dj you want to drink you want to be a hop skip and a jump away not even a hop skip and a jump literally like a two minute walk from the beach um definitely check out nikki beach we did go down to the actual beach and kind of frolic in the water you know we had a time and everyone loved my swimsuit my andrea iyama swimsuit with my loewe scarf um, it just worked and then my Alexander McQueen sunglasses So I'll be sure to link all of those things down below the bathing suit is still available. I had um, a medium I'm normally a US size 6. So yeah All in all a really great day Like as soon as me and Gloria got back here both of us did a little bit of work and then we went to sleep y'all um, So yeah, I have on my skims Dress it's a little house dress. I'll link it down below um it's about 10 a.m and the we have a yacht today from 12 to 1. um it was like really dark and rainy earlier but the sun came out thank goodness i had the boat catered from a taco spot called huya huya um we've done that spot once before on a previous yacht day i think for new year's though and the food was pretty good we're gonna head there pick up the catered food and then head to the boat but it should be fun if you all are looking i have two different companies that i use i use miami yachting company that's the one i've used the most i've also used atlantic charters which is a person of color owned business um so yeah i'll put details for both of those down below if you're looking to rent a yacht the yacht that i rented because of the size of it and because of the hours I want, it came out to about $3,000 for the four hours. And that includes the tip. So it just depends on the boat, what time you're leaving, how many people are going to be there, what all you want, what all you need, if you want cater or not. So yeah, just check out the details. Um, but yeah, let me get ready. And then we will head to the boat. All right, guys. So we are all ready. The earrings are, it's all couture which is a black owned business Fenty unveil on my lips i will give you guys a closer look but ready to go here is the birthday look this two-piece set i'll link it it's uh i think i got it at farfetch and i might even have a code for you all at farfetch and the little sarong you guys know i love a sarong moment i don't know i'm just a little more modest with showing my bottom half i don't know why like it's fire but still <laughs> um it's uh, from Rat and Boa and it actually goes to another like two piece bathing suit. But I like how this has that same orange that matches with this. And this can even be worn as a top. I'm wearing a medium, but I probably could have gotten a small. But in the bottom, definitely a medium. I'm gonna pack up my Loewe basket bag. I'm gonna wear the same Chanel dad sandals I wore yesterday. I'm gonna go ahead and call my Alto. Um, and we are going to head to the liquor store and then we need to pick up the food and then we're heading to the boat. I did a pretty, a pretty serious face today just because I know I'll be taking photos and I brought a little things to like touch it up, but I won't really care. After I get the photos, we're getting in the water. We're having fun. Um, all right. So that's the look feeling very cute, feeling very, it's my birthday. Let's go ahead and pack 
up and head out. All right, guys, we're on the move. Always oh, catching me. Everyone's there. <laughs> Everyone's here. Everyone's here. Hello. Everyone's there. <laughs> All right, guys, we're on the boat. Here's the tour. Here's the tour. Here's the tour. All right, you come in. It's a nice sitting area. There's a nice kitchen. There's a, you're the captain, yeah. I'm the captain. This is the captain. Captain Mike. Captain Mike. I'll put his information below. This is the kitchen. How cute. We have all of our food. We have some flowers. Can I draw the boat? Uh, yes. Okay, I can draw the boat. I'm the captain now. <laughs> Down here we have a bed, a bathroom. I don't know what's in these two places, but it's really nice. And then you come up here. And it's a beautiful like sun deck. Have a place in the back where you can hang out. A little table here. It's really nice. And then of course you have the front of the boat there where lots of photos will be taken. So that's the tea. I'll put the boat information down below. This is Miami Yachting Company. Um, the Lumar boat. And we about to turn up. So let's do it. All right, guys, we're off. I am the captain now. And we about to turn up. We just had a shot. My esophagus is burning. I just wanted to have a quiet moment out here alone, you know, just to reflect on my new age. Happy that I made it here, thank God. Um, I'm able to see another year. A lot of people didn't get to do that, so I'm grateful. Um, and now we about to turn up, so. If you don't want to see booty shaking, drinks being drank, and black folk having fun, uh, this is the point where you should exit the video um, because it's about to get stupid in the best way possible. Ready? Ready. We are ready. 